Hi, this is Paul Carlson, CPA with Law Firm Velocity. In this video, we're going to run a work in progress report from ProLaw. Um, we will jump in and run the report and we can explain exactly what this report tells us when we get there. So from the home page, we're gonna click reports. We want to select WIP aging. WIP is work in progress. Want to set the date as of when you want to see the balances of unbilled work. I'm using ProLaw sample data, and based on the sample data, I need to use December 2010, even though it's 2017 right now. Um, you would typically want to run a WIP report as of the last day of the prior month, or as of today, depending on what numbers you want to see. So with the date set, we're going to start the query. And from here, we can preview the report. And we want the listing version because that has the aging behind it. And here we have a report of all of the matters within the firm where we have unbilled time and expenses. So these are new time charges and these are expense charges that have not been billed to clients. A different way to think of this is pre-receivables, that this is accounts receivable and for some reason we're not getting the bill out the door and the longer the bill doesn't go out means the odds of collecting go down and this is just cash that the firm needs but we're not billing it for some reason. Um, so let's look at the totals. So what you would want to, as a management tool, you want to follow up with anything that's in the over 30, over 16, over 90 column that we want to chase down the attorneys in charge of these matters and understand why these matters have not been billed and get those invoices out today. To print the reports, we can use a print icons, we can change the print layout, or we can export this report into Excel or PDF. And with that, that's how we run a work in progress report from ProLaw. If you need any help with your law firm's accounting, please check us out at Law Firm Velocity. Bye.